Alrighty. Here we go, guys. Solo goblin caves. Got a good spawn here next to the centipede. If I can make it over. Take him out real quick. I think it's going to be quicker with the halberd. Too hard to dodge his uh, spitting poison, though. Let's see. No. Uh, I was really hoping he didn't go this way. I think I can still squeeze out to the right. Eh. Maybe not, actually, anymore. But let's take him out quick. Try to get these uh, purple rings in pendants. Plus, get a lot of AP points. I don't really go for rank, but... It's good to just kill him. I mean, plus he spawned right here. Yeah, that was pretty fast. So we got a wind locket and two wind lockets. Nice. Okay, I hear somebody to my right. Okay, they're actually... It's a fighter. Crossbow. Dodge that. He's got a couple goblins on him. He's stuck. This is pretty bad because I'm taking more... Oh, shit. <clears throat> Look at your gear is out! Oh my god, I actually didn't even feel that. It's literally one shot. Oh my gosh, dude. Uh, we gotta pop this. The goblin's yelling at us, but we're just gonna take the hell shrine here. I literally... <laughs> oh, damn. I almost died there, but, uh, hey. We're alive. Still alive, but I'm barely breathing. Hopefully I don't get, like, copyright striked for, <laughs> for that or something. <laughs> hey, this man's geared. Happily take all his stuff here. Okay, that's not good. It's alright. You can Hound Skull. Dark Plate Armor is pretty valuable. Uh, that's not good. Those are pretty good. Five moves. Eight. True physical damage. Made the Surgy Kit. He had a lot of heals for us. Okay, yep. Yeah. Actually, better protection potions than what we have. Always like some candy canes. Just kind of fill up on these pots here. Uh, those boots are actually pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Take them too. But yeah, I should have probably backed up there. Um, Phantomize might... Like, I didn't know the goblins were on his back, right? Uh, otherwise, I, I probably wouldn't have pushed if I knew that going into it. But uh, yeah, we took a lot more damage being in Phantomize and taking that poison damage. And then he just got hit off right off. Um, right after we came out of Phantom Eye, so it's probably a headshot too. <laughs> Almost died there, but uh, hey, we did not. Grab an extra potion. Somebody just opened the door. He's walking around. Be all sneaky like. Take a maybe we'll take a little take a little visit here through the storm. Little gander. Figured he might have jumped down. See if the uh, centipede was up. Yeah, I don't see him. Well, maybe we'll run into him later. Hello? Didn't do their stacks up actually, too. Bring us up to five. So check and see if anybody healed the centipede over here and obviously just shut the door. So if that guy does jump down, then, uh, you know, he doesn't sneak up on us. Okay, let's drag him outside of the storm. Okay, crouch here so I don't hit the ceiling. Say that as I hit the ceiling. <laughs> and yeah, I kind of figured it was going to be part of just to dodge the poison with this, so. Small room, which is to do with the uh, crystal sword as I still manage to hit the wall somehow. That wide third swing. Ooh, I thought I was going to get hit. i hit by all the poison, though. It's never good. Let's try to get a, a couple of heals off here before. Uh, Guy comes back. We should be able to get this bandage off. Kind of just touch him back up. Oh. I'll just dodge the poison like that. Right, okay. Figured he had it below. Pretty sure that's above us anyway. 
nothing good. Shall be running into these people here soon enough. This is not the regular goblin cave, so... We can get up through these stairs to our right. Hello, good sir. Pop a blue potion. I think that was a rogue. Hello, Mr. Rogue. Look at you. Look at you geared as hell. Oh my god, he killed a man! Ah, oh, yes. Look at that fighter over there. Yes. There, look at you. I want to fight you. I want to fight you. Hello, Mr. PDR fighter. I am the bane of your existence. Yes, yes. Well then, wow. Quite a few of you are there, yes, yes. This will be fun. Mr. Fighter! <sighs> Quite a few of you, yes, yes. One down, three to go. Hey, wait for my cooldowns real quick. Let's just wait. Oh my god, dude, there's too many people here. Hey, you want some too? Hey. Hmm. There really are quite a few of you, aren't there? Run it. Bag here. All right, there's another. Better get out of here. Better leave. You're next. All right, let's do this then. Sorry, Mr. P Mr. But you will have to die, yes, a painful death, yes, yes. My fists are out, get your ass back in! <laughs> Alright, well, we got these two guys here, so let's see what we got. Ooh, Ray of Courage, you don't mind if I do, plus one all. Ooh, yeah, definitely taking those, damn, those are really good too. Treasures. Oh, that's not that good. Let's check out this guy head. I don't think there should be anybody else in this lobby. I would really hope not. Dang. Dang. Okay. Additional magic damage. Ooh, that's good for me. This one. Oh, rapier. Honestly, the heater shield. I don't think these pants are going to sell well. I mean, the heater shield's nice, I just feel like they don't sell for a lot. I don't think pants do either, honestly. Oh. Yeah, we want them, we want them. I think it's time to, yeah, drop the heater shield. And I kind of do want some more lock picks. Oh, nice. Encourage. Full loot. Full loot. Let's go, boys. That <laughs> last guy did not want anything. Holy! Gear it up, baby. Gear it up. <laughs> minus 50! <laughs> you killed the entire lobby. You minus. <laughs> Feels so bad, dude. Holy.
All right, a whopping 35 gold <laughs> from sellables with the 15 that we found in raid. And brings us to 50. All right, only thing left to do is try to sell all this stuff and see how much we made. All right, guys, three gold ingots for the Stark plate armor. All right, guys, two gold ingots for these reinforced gloves. Six gold ingots for the heavy leather leggings and the hound skull. Selling the falchion for 250. Rapier selling for 400. And also selling the short sword for 400. <laughs> All right, guys, 285 for the loose trousers. Honestly, I'm surprised how hard they were to sell. Figured that these would sell really quickly. All right, next up, I'm going to try to sell the rings and pendants. And actually, I'm not going to sell this one. This one is just an upgrade for me. So I'm going to hold on to this one. I don't know. I guess I, can, I need to organize my inventory, but uh, I'll try to sell the rest of these. And also, if you uh, <laughs> saw that the gold count doesn't really match, I uh, was <laughs> I was trading buying some uh, some good deals when I saw them. Uh, but yeah, let's try to sell these. All right, guys, 250 gold for this ring of courage. 150 gold for this wind locket. 250 gold for this ring of quickness. 200 gold for this ring of courage. All right, and instead of vendoring these, we're going to give them away for free. Figure it's better than uh, vendoring them. <laughs> All right, guys, so I'll put the total that we made on screen. Uh, I'm going to assume that the ingots are worth 600 gold. That's how much they're going for right now. And we ended up making 11 of them, which, uh, yeah, we made a lot of gold this video, plus whatever, you know, we sold everything else for. So I'll put that up on screen. And again, guys, if you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. I'm working toward 1,000 subscribers, and I would really appreciate it if you guys subscribed if you enjoyed it. All right, I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.